So as you can see here, I've got the net rolled up. This is, like I said, this is a 164 foot roll, so it's fairly heavy. For smaller frame people, I recommend getting two of the 80, 80 feet rolls. I believe they come in 81 feet rolls or 82 feet. They're just easier to handle. You pay a little bit more per foot, but they're much, I'd much rather have two 82 feet pieces than 164 foot. And I'll tell you a little tip on why that is maybe at the end of this video or in another post that I put out. So I'm gonna go move the chickens. I've got them locked up in the chicken coop. So I'm gonna roll them right out here, get them in their new spot, and then I'm gonna build the fence around them. And that's the best way to move, move your chickens and your fence, you know, in one shot. So we got the chickens moved now into their new spot where they're going to be right over there and there's my wire folded up all nice and neatly so I'm going to go grab that and start laying it out exactly where I want them to be Gonna take the loose end, throw it out there, and just start walking. If we got to fold it up right, it'll come off just fine. So I'm gonna pick back up right here. Head back up around that way and roll the whole fence out. So I'm going to grab one of these loose ends. You can see it's got a double prong on the bottom. That gives you a little spot to push down on your foot. It's really hard to push these single stake ones in on the ground just by hand. Sometimes you have to use a drill to start your hole. But you just grab it. Come out here to where you want to start. And I've got really hard ground here. It hadn't rained in like 10 days. So I'm just going to start that one right there and walk along. And I like to take my foot, pull the bottom, push my foot up against the bottom, and that takes the slack out of that bottom line there. And that really helps you to have a really tight fence. So you get the first couple up, and it goes pretty quickly. You just keep stepping them in. Like so. 